Yo guys, this is Mozen Lens, so I'm just going to make a little video about my render effects version 2. I um I made um tutorial of this um but it's not that good so I tried to um I tried some things here on Photoshop Touch so to make it better so first um what you're going to need is just go into the link in the description and download the Photoshop touch so yeah let's get started so now first what you're going to need is just put the render that you are going to put a effect on it so here it is guys so first this render is not mine so I didn't make it so I will leave the cred credit for this render to my um, friend speedy gfx so he he has a youtube channel so he made some amazing speed art about minecraft banner so so first what you're going to need is just go here in the plus button and then basically just make a empty layer go to the layer of the on the layer of the render go in here select pixels and then basically go on the end sign and then oops first what you're going to need is just switch on the new layer that we made go to the end sign and go to gradient so basically make a gradient like that um black and white make sure it's black and white go on the um click the check mark button and then what you're going to need is just go in here put the blend mode into overlay and pl put the opacity something like 80 percent and then go and merge it down so now what you are going to need is just basically go here on the plus button duplicate the layer of the render um go here in the fx button click edges and put the back color into like zero opacity just like that and put the width into like um and put the threshold first into like one percent and put the width into something like um three percent just like that click the check mark button and go into the blend mode put it into liner dodge go in the opacity and put it into 35 percent so just like that and go here on the tools just like that and then switch into eraser tool and put the brush into like the size is um 200 percent so put the hardness into 10 and the flow is 9 percent so basically zoom it and then just basically erase some things on it just like that just randomly erase like that so as you can see it's like that guys so go and then merge it down just like that and go and make another um, duplicate layer of the render go into FX button go to stylize or artistic go to comic and put the color something like um, 5 um, something like 15 maybe let's try it just like that put the edge level um, into 100% and put the intensity into 15% just like that maybe put the color like 10 oops sorry guys so just like that guys and click the check mark button make the blend mode into overlay and put the opacity down into 35% just like that and click the check mark button so now guys what you are going to need is just make a new layer and then basically just deselect the render just go in here and then click the select and go to end sign make sure you are on the layer of the new layer that we made go to fill and stroke just make it like that go to the render layer select pixels then go to the um layer of the background go here like the pencil thingy go in here and then click cut and then what we're going to need is just um basically deselect it again oops select go to fx make sure you are again in the um, white background layer go to basic gaussian blur make the gaussian blur to 20 percent click the check mark button and then go in here in the layer of the render click in here select pixels go to the layer of the white background um click the pencil thingy and then go and extract it just like that and then go and deselect it again make sure you are on the layer of the white background that we made a while go and put the blend mode into overlay and then duplicate it just like that um 
merge the layer that we duplicate go in here and then lower down the opacity into 90% just like that as you can see it has the um the inner shadow just like that and go and merge it on the layer so we only have one layer of the render go in here and then put the curve um little just like that click la click the check mark button so that's basically it guys so if you want to put some glitter eyes in here oops if you want to put some eye glitters on it so you can basically just put it there so i will also leave a um glitters pack for ps touch on the download link or the description sorry guys for my wrong grammar so that's basically it guys so i hope you learned from this video and i hope you enjoy it so please click that like button for more tutorial and subscribe for me so yeah thank you for watching see you in the next video goodbye no!